What's up guys? Welcome to Dan's how-to videos. Today we're continuing the how-to series on the Apple Magic Mouse. If you missed any of the previous videos, the link is in the description. You can check it out, how to connect it, how to set it up, and use all the gestures with the Magic Mouse. But today we're going to be talking about the Magic Mouse battery. So I'm going to go through the battery life. I'm going to show you guys how to change it, as well as how to check on the percentage that you have left on the Magic Mouse battery. Anyway guys, let's get started. All right, so the first thing we're gonna go through is the physical aspect of this video, and that is changing the batteries on your Magic Mouse. Now, you need to turn your Magic Mouse over, and you have a little tab here at the bottom. You wanna click it down towards the bottom of your mouse, and this will unveil the batteries and open up this little tray here. Once you've got it open, you just need to replace the batteries with two AA batteries. And once you've done that, simple as putting it back in, you just put the camera end or the lens end there at the top and push down and you're pretty much good to go. Switch your Bluetooth back on and your computer should connect to it. The next thing we're gonna go through is the battery percentage for the Magic Mouse. If you wanna check how much battery life you have left, you need to go into your system preferences. It'll take you to this box and you wanna click on mouse. Now at the bottom here, it'll say mouse battery level and it'll show you your percentage. Now I've been using mine for about two weeks at heavy usage, so that's six to eight hours a day and I've got 75% battery left. So personally, I think that's really good if you choose a cheap set of batteries, you may notice a slight difference in your battery percentage. The Magic Mouse came pre-equipped with Energizer Advance, and this is an alkaline battery. My personal experience is that all alkaline batteries are very similar, whether they're a name brand or not. So as long as you pick up alkaline batteries that are decent, you should be good to go. Now also, you have to keep in mind, it's how you use it, how many times you're connecting and disconnecting, because that will drain the battery a lot quicker. It's got to search for the Bluetooth. So keep that in mind. Subscribe up top. Hit that like button if you enjoyed the video and found it helpful it really helps me out also leave a comment down below what your battery life experiences are with the magic mouse anyway guys i'll see you in the next one